Oh, that's what we uh, we bargain for excitement. That's what we try for. That's our game plan: be as exciting as possible. No, uh, you, you know, uh, just we just said to our guys, you know, if you if you quit or or or, or you know, kind of turn on each other at three one or four three, you don't get a chance to come back. So, kudos to our guys for sticking with it and having the heart and uh, and character to keep uh, competing. I made the power play uh, count uh, late there, so uh, going to get back to. Well, yeah, I mean, and, and I think we two games ago we had some good patience on the power play and we had some good results, and last game we were really hurried. I think when we have patience, we have guys that can, can make plays and we just have to settle things down a little bit. So you come back late to tie it and lose the lead right away, you get it again. Just like you said before, there's no quit, but talk about what that means to a young team this early in the year. Well, it's a big win. It's a, it gets us to 500. We've got uh, you know some some points there early in the year and, and are in the mix in the middle of our conference. And uh, after 10 games, if that's uh, where we said we'd be, we'd be happy with that start and something for us to build on. One win shy of uh, tying last year's home win uh, output. What's the uh, the key to kind of adjusting to this building uh, this season? Ah, I mean, I, I think being here a year, we, we're a little bit uh, more used to playing here. I think we have different uh, personnel, obviously, that uh, we're, we're able to match up a little bit and, and, and shut teams down a little bit with some of the guys we have. So um, it, it's been good so far. A lot of big names have come through this organization. Talk about it's, it's young, it's early, but talk about Rilo Konecki and the impact he's had so far. Well, I mean, I think uh, you see different parts of the first 10 games where he's had uh, incredible plays and then some, some tough plays and some more incredible plays and uh, just, you know, obviously uh, a good start to his OHL career. He's helped us win, um, not playing uh, too many minutes or in situations where he's not having success. At the same time, when he's going, we, we get him out on the ice a little bit more as well. We're certainly giving him a lot of responsibility, having him out there uh, with 30 seconds left and needing a goal. Yeah, well, I thought he was uh, he was one of our best guys up front tonight offensively, and if not our best guy, and definitely uh, helped us win. As part of the game plan getting to uh, their goalie, he seemed to get a little rattled in the third there. Ah, I mean, it's it's a tight game for a long time with both goalies making all kinds of stops, and then all of a sudden there's there's some goals both ways. So I think that's just uh, junior hockey, and you know we look forward to our road trip here coming up on uh, Thursday. Just beyond the goals, though, even just crashing him and getting in his face. Well, we want to go to the net all the time, so whether we did it more or better in the third period, but uh, that's our plan to get to the net and create chances. Why won't you look at me? <laughs>